we're talking about the real life heroes amongst us. Our next guest is a different kind of hero. He is trying to take his own devastating personal tragedy and turn it into something positive. Here's Kyle's story. One of my biggest regrets. The night before that I wrecked, I promised my mom I would never drink and drive. I didn't know if he was going to live. I didn't know if he was going to die. It was very, very emotional. Do you know what it's like to have your 18 year old son look at you, broken all pieces? Why the need to, to help him? You know, I, I was in Atlanta at the world famous Shepherd Center, which is a, an institute for brain and spinal cord injuries. And I met Kyle. And here's this young man. He can't talk. He's on a ventilator. He's completely broken up. And we're talking. And I said, Kyle, what are you going to do with your life now? He said, I want to help others. I'm like, who says that? You know? Heroes say that. <laughs> Heroes say that. And at the time, uh, I, I run a, a LEAP. It's called LEAP. It's a program at UCLA for high school and college kids. It's an inspirational, motivational program. I said, Kyle, when you get better, you're going to come to my LEAP Foundation. You're going to talk to these kids, and you're going to inspire them, and you're going to tell them your story. Because if you can save one of them, it's all worth it, you know? All worth it, it is. Amazing. Amazing. What would you like to say to him, Kyle? I would like to tell everybody that you are looking at one of the most amazing and magnificent men. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, he gives more opportunities than I could ever express in words. I would never have a chance to be here. I'd have never been able to come to L.A. This is a man who is willing to help somebody out of the kindness of his heart. Mm -hmm. And that's what I want. I think he's one of the most eloquent speakers I've I've he, met in a long amazing. time. So he's could there amazing. be a future for him in speaking publicly about this? Well, that's what we started at Leap, and we're going to help him develop it. Yeah. And we had talked about different things that Kyle could do. And, mm -hmm. you know, he thought about being a therapist or psychologist. And I said, Kyle, you're never going to be able to do that unless you get a college degree, because you have to be able Educate. To be educated, to educate people. Yeah. And so I have a little surprise for you, Kyle. What else? We hmm. did some research, and I found an amazing university for you. Colorado Technical University wow. is going to grant you the opportunity to get a college degree through a full-paid four-year grant. Oh, my God. They're going to give you your full tuition. They're going to give you all of the fees that you need for the courses. They're going to give you a program that will be done at your own pace, where you can do it, in your house, on your computer. So it's virtual. It's a virtual online course. And not only that, they will help cater oh the gosh. program to you for your specific learning abilities. And Kyle, if 23,000 kids can do this, you can too. Oh. And so amazing. Thank you. So much. Thank, thank you, Dr. Bill. You don't really know what that means. I, I, oh, you don't. my goodness. I mean, now I feel like as a mama, he has a chance.